Hey guys, Chris here from fitnesscampacademy.com and I help frustrated men and women understand diet and exercise so they can get the body back in less than 28 days and maintain that for life. So, recently I've been going through a little bit of a transformation and a little bit of frustration because I think I'm trying to help people out there and there's not really, sometimes people aren't taking the advice on board or they're after free advice and then I try to give free advice and they're not taking it on board. So, that is one of my frustrations. Another frustration is other trainers out there basically saying, buy my shit. Okay, so you've probably seen loads of businesses on Facebook posting up, oh, this for free, or come and get this at this price, or there's a boot camp session tonight, and it drives me insane. Let's be honest, we come to Facebook to hang out with mates, okay? It's not a place for businesses to sell. Yes, I run my business through Facebook, and I'll be honest about that, but... What I try and do is provide value to people. So I try to educate people and allow them to see actually what we do as, as a company without actually saying, buy this, buy this, buy this all the time. Because I think this is one of the frustrations. I've been trying to help people, but people aren't always ready for it. And at the end of the day, if you're on Facebook just chilling out in your house, you don't want somebody knocking on your front door constantly saying, do you want to come buy this electricity? It just pisses you off. Especially when you're getting phone calls through like constant phone calls trying to sell things. The last thing you want to do when you're just relaxing in the evening is trying to get some somebody selling you on Facebook. So over the next 30 days, I'm going to post a video a day of my video diary and my results uh, that I'm going through my very own body transformation. The reason I'm doing this is because I want to show you that we as trainers are human and we go through exactly the same things that you do as people. Often, we are de dehumanized by the public, so we people look at us like machines. I met a lady yesterday from my networking group that I've known for weeks, and she was like, I just thought you were about training and exercise. When actually I'm quite a spiritual guy, I'm quite a deep guy, and some of the people that know us will, will tell you that. And Other people aren't deep, that's not their thing, but I'm not just this meathead trainer, or I'm not just this trainer that beasts people. I actually look at people's problems and... I like to, to figure out the emotions behind the reason that people are in this position. So I have relaxed a little bit with my food recently and I want to up my training. Although I've been getting great results, my strength's been improving, I have been having a few more cheat, cheat meals than I would usually. So I want to increase my accountability and show you guys that it can be done. It just takes a little bit of dedication and hard work. So I'm going to be posting up photos and a, a video diary every single day just going through what training I've done, what sort of struggles I'm feeling, if I'm craving things, how I've combated the cravings, how I'm actually dropping fat, the nutrition, the meals that I'm having, and a lot of stuff like that that's going to help you. So if you follow along with my journey, you'll get a major amount of information out of it. I'm doing this because I want to help people, but I want to influence them and show that I am human too, rather than just saying, do this, do this, do this. I'm going to take you through it step by step myself. If anybody wants to join me on this journey, then great. I'm more than happy to help you. I will, if, you, if you're if you happy to do a video diary every day like this, just using your webcam, then I'll give you the training and nutrition plan that I'm going to be doing, and I shall guide you through the whole process. The deal is that you do a video diary every day if I'm going to help you, because I want you committed and serious to doing it. If you don't do that, then cool. Just follow along, take the information and apply it to your gym program. Then down the line, if coming to work with us is something that you'd like to do, then that's cool. But if not, then that's also cool because at the end of the day, if I can help people and it's a finance thing and I can help people and they get a lot out of the information that I'm sharing, then that's me doing my job. I'm not in this to make money. I'm in this to change lives. And if I didn't make money, I'd probably still do it. In fact, I definitely would still do it because I'm enjoy I enjoy learning about nutrition, learning about the body, learning about lifestyle. And the things away from exercise. So exercise is probably one of the least thing, the least important things that you need to do. That's just the icing on the cake. The first is the mindset. Then you've got your basically your, all the nutrition. That, that accounts for around 70% of the results. I'd say 20% of the results are accounted for by the mindset and the strength of your mind. Um, so around 90% of that is nutrition and mindset and getting that emotional relationship back with food so you're not having this disconnect with food that a lot of people do a lot of people go through the food reward sort of thing so i've been good so i'm going to have this food 
I'm trying to get myself away from that because even though I understand it, I still generally do it. Like I'll say Monday to Friday or Monday to Saturday afternoon, right, I've been really good, I'm in town, I'm gonna have a cake or I'll take my girlfriend out for a meal or we'll go out for a meal together. And I always, I used to use the excuse that I've been good all week, so I'll reward myself with food, but then you're rewarding yourself with bad food, then you feel guilty for it on the back end. So you actually go through a bit of a stress response while you're doing this, and to be honest, it's not the best way to build a relationship with food, especially when people have emotional detachment from food. So what I'd like you to do is the first step is to try and build your relationship with food. So instead of rewarding yourself with food for being being good and sticking to a nutrition plan, actually reward yourself with something positive. So maybe you go out and buy yourself a dress or you go out and buy yourself a new outfit, a pair of jeans. Fellas out there, you might actually go and do something like take yourself to the football match or just do anything that you want to do, but reward it with a positive thing that's going to impact your lifestyle. Something that's going to reduce stress, increase your motivation for the program and not going to make you feel pretty shitty. Get out of the mindset of saying, I'm going to have this because I've been good. Now, I know my nutrition is really good all the time or 80-90% of the time. So if I decide to have something, it's because I've made the decision to have it, not because I've been good. I understand the, the consequences of eating that food and I know how to get back on the wagon straight away. So that is majorly important. If you can get your head around that, then the whole relationship with food and the emotions attached become so much easier. Okay? So guys, I invite you to join me over the next 30 days on my nutrition and training diary, which I'll be posting daily with updates. And I hope I can help you on your own journey as well. I hope you can relate and see that as a trainer, we still go through the same things. We still get cravings. We still get all of the things that you guys go through. Don't forget, I've been there before in the past. I was a skinny fat guy, so I was skinny, but I had a bit of a fat belly. I couldn't build muscle because my nutrition was crap, my sleep was crap, my lifestyle wasn't allowing me to get the body that I wanted. That's exactly the same as what a lot of my clients are going through. Weight loss, is it's very simple. It's not easy, but it's very simple. If you follow the basics and you stick to the plan, stay, keep yourself accountable, keep others, get others to keep you accountable, follow the plan, you will get results, simple as that. Okay, so thank you for watching. I hope this was inspirational. I hope you're enjoying or looking forward to seeing what I'm gonna go through in the next 30 days. I'll try and get some video snippets of the training that I'm doing as well and alongside the little bits of video diary. Okay guys, keep tuning in. Thank you for watching. That's Chris Brown, fitnesscampacademy.com, helping men and women understand diet and exercise so they can get their body back in less than 28 days and maintain it for life. Bye-bye.